Is that what we're talking about? Comas? How we get into yeah. that? Yeah, the, I like your podcast idea of going to somebody with a coma that you have a lot to get out, and they're in a coma now, and you could just tell everything. Just go 40 minutes, you know, yeah. just go 45 minutes, just talking about your feelings with no nothing coming back. Well, it's somebody interesting, because sometimes you need that. You just post the whatever the relationship, whatever the relationship is, and then you just go right into it. But I don't know if hospice would be cool with it. But also, if you could get a blip on their thing, you'd fucking, that would be it. It'd be like oh, blip yeah. hunters. And we yeah. go and yeah. we sit with somebody who's in a coma and they have their line or whatever right. on their heart reading. Right. And if you can fucking get them to blip or something. You know you got through. That yeah. person wins, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's great. Turn it into a and if he doesn't, if you don't get a blip, then you're like, this guy's good. He's got his, <laughs> this guy. This you're guy. like, he doesn't feel any. You're like, no, no, he's uh, he's willing. <laughs> yeah, it would be if you knew you were gonna die mm -hmm. and still not give it anything in at all. Man, that's it's a strong person. Yeah, to go to the grave with something, right? Yeah, I don't know if I go to the grave with all my secrets. Mm -hmm. You got to tell them to somebody, tell them to a nephew, right? Tell them to somebody who doesn't need, you know, a nephew. <laughs> and throw that all on a nephew, like a young nephew. Oh, a nephew is just a time capsule for your bullshit, I feel yeah. like, you know? Yeah, a nephew. Yeah, it's like someone that's like, I didn't really know my uncle. And then I really knew my uncle. <laughs> like, just right before he died, he yeah. just yeah. unleashed on me. <laughs> and I got to carry that around. <laughs> That's my mom. He was talking like he, you know, like just a lot. It's just a lot to throw on a nephew, but it's got to go somewhere. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. Um, to get back to kind of what you guys were saying about like, yeah, I think having clips and stuff obviously is helpful to people these days. Yeah. I think people more than ever want to see uh some person, a person get to know a person and their personality. Yes. Yeah. You know, I think it's even what's nice about being involved in like podcasting world. Yeah. And, um is that people want to get to know somebody because for so long it was so formulaic. It was like, you just got this person um, that had kind of been through this system and the, the system was all kind of dictated and that's who kind of got to a level where people were able to see their work. Mm -hmm. Right. You know, and now I think um, people are wanting to get to know people more Right. Maybe, hypothetically, I'm guessing. Yeah. And then so they listen to podcasts and they get to know people. They get to know people that are on the episodes. It's it's a pretty small universe after a while. Yeah. Right. And then um and so then they feel a little bit more connection. So then when they're sitting in the audience, they're also getting to see this person. Yeah. Yeah. Uh this person and not just the material. Mm-hmm. Um, they get to know where it kind of comes from. Right. Yeah, I think they you know, I sat in the audience one night, I was watching a um I was watching a guy who, a podcaster, and I was like, oh, a lot of the audience, I could feel it. They're just excited to be here in the room with me. Right. Yeah, oh, yeah. You know, it's cool. Yeah. And right. I even thought, I was like, man, yeah, this is cool. We're literally just hanging out with them here. If the material is good or bad, yeah. we're hanging out with them yeah. here. You know, yeah, it's pretty that's, cool. Yeah, it, that's where the, you get, they got to feel the love, though. Like, it's like the, you know, like when you say, when people go see you live, it's, uh, they they want to be able to feel that appreciation you have for them coming out mm. and like that like that doesn't need to be taken advantage of because it's it's a it, you know people it's you know expensive to go see anything oh, or do yeah. anything anymore and so they they want to feel that you care as much as they do that's a good point man I got to remember that sometimes to let people know that I care. You know, sometimes I, I don't forget. I think it shows. I, I, it's going to show. I think it shows. I've seen you at your shows, and I think it shows. 